Welcome back to another episode of Arrested Development. Two guys, two minutes, talk about rust, and today we're gonna to be talking about the real cost of a rust issue. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. When it comes to rust, there is more than meets the eye, and we're gonna dive into it right now. Now, the story of rust, and the two guys who talked about it in two minutes. It's Arrested Development. Now, before we get rocking and a rolling, we're gonna put two minutes on the clock because that's just what we do. We're not gonna listen to the clock, but we're gonna put two minutes on it anyway. Three, two, one. <clears throat> rust issues are expensive. That's exactly right. Worldwide, annually, rust issues cause about $276 billion worth of damage every single year. Now that's on a global scale, but on an individual company scale, an individual line or plant scale, it's still a huge, huge cost that businesses around the world endure. Now to better illustrate exactly what we're talking about when we talk about this rust issue, this broad cost of rust issue, we like to compare it to an iceberg. Iceberg wide ahead. Did you see? Iceberg right ahead. Thank you. Unlike how the Titanic couldn't steer away from that iceberg that just decimated it, we wanna help steer you away from the rust iceberg. Now, when it comes to the rust iceberg, there are two different parts, right? There's the part that you can see, the little part that's sticking up out of the water. Those are the visible costs. And then, in the words of Queen, fat bottom ice, you make the rust world expensive. Fat bottom girls, you make the rocket world go round. So, Let's get down into it. Let's talk about the tippity top and that fat bottom that's hiding under the water. So let's say you have a manufacturing plant and let's say you're making 20,000 parts a day. 20,000 of these parts. Now let's say of those 20,000, I don't know, maybe five or 6,000 are having some sort of a rust issue, whether catastrophic or just some rust along the edges. That is a visible cost. That's something that now someone who's on the assembly line who originally is manufacturing this part is now having to sort that part, sort the good ones, sort the bad ones, or they're gonna have to scrape the rust off that part. Visible cost, super annoying, tip of the iceberg. Now let's get into that fat bottom dice that we talked about before. The part of the iceberg that you can't see the part of the iceberg that sunk the Titanic and could very well sink your process. Now here at Armor, we care about a couple things. We care about you, your product, your parts, your brand, and we care about your reputation. That is an unseen cost of rust. If you are shipping a rusted metal part across the country, your customer can't wait to open it. Like a kid on Christmas morning, they rip it open and they find <gasps> rust everywhere. That is gonna be a mark against you in the reputation category. Don't let that happen. There are also associated costs with expedited freight. And as we all know, fuel costs are going up. Then there's the 8D meetings. You're asking yourself why five times. There's some guy up there drawing fish bones up on a board with a dry erase marker. And you're saying it's been 84 years. It's been 84 years. All of that costs extra money. Those people are all being taken away from their regular day jobs and having to solve an issue that they didn't even need to have in the first place. And the reason they didn't need to have it is because Armor VCI nanotechnology exists. You have heard Celine Dion's My Heart Will Go On. Well, guess what? You can put your part in a VCI bag and your part will go on all the way to China or Germany or California, wherever you're shipping it to, and it will be rust free because rust free is the way to be. So this was a rust of development. Two guys, two minutes, talk about rust. And today we talked about the extensive fat bottomed iceberg costs of rust that you can endure in a manufacturing setting. So if you have any questions about rust removal or rust prevention, you know who to call. That's right. Don't let rust sink your ship. I'm Chris. And I'm Kelvin. Have a great day, everyone.